I am so excited to show all of you Screen Sensation fans out there how we can finally make our own screens. This is the MIOS 280 machine, make your own screen. Look how compact it is, it's incredible. Let's have a look. Okay, so we need to print an image onto acetate. Here's the image that we're going to create the screen from. It needs to be a black image on acetate. So you can see there, it's just printed on the acetate. Let's get the mesh, so exciting. The mesh comes to you in a special envelope. It's a light sensitive material, so it's sealed in here. So we take the mesh out of there and pop it onto the black plate. So I'm just gonna take one piece of mesh out of the envelope and pop it onto there. Now this is a light sensitive material, so you need to make sure that you seal the envelope back up before you pop it away. We'll pop the mesh onto there and now we're gonna pop our image over the top. And this black image on the acetate is gonna prevent the light from the machine going through the mesh and curing the emulsion. So the area that is black will become the screen that you print. We're gonna pop the clear plate over the top switch the machine on. The speed is determined by the amount of detail in your design and that's fully detailed in the instruction book. I'm going to select speed two for this one and we're just going to pop it into the machine. Now you'll see that the machine grabs the sandwich, don't need to feed it through, it's grabbed it and it's taken the, the set of plates there. This is going to create our own bespoke screen. It is absolutely incredible in seconds. It's going to take about 15 seconds, 20 seconds for it to pass through depending on how uh, which setting you're working with and it, it's your own screen. You've designed it. It can be a, a logo that you've created, it can be your own handwriting, it can be something that you've drawn, it can be something the kids have drawn and then you can print it onto anything as you would with anything screen sensation. How amazing is that? So I'm just going to catch the plates at the other side. So the machine is silent, you can't hear it go through at all. So the machine releases the plates when it's finished. Just going to pop that there for now while I bring in my tray of water. So this is just regular tap water. I'm going to lift off the top plate and the acetate and we're going to pop this screen into the water. It just needs to be fully submerged in cold water for a few seconds. And you can see there that the logo is already coming through. Instantly, it's there. I'm gonna take a soft brush and we're just gonna gently rub the screen to remove the emulsion that has coated the screen. So we're just gonna go across the image, just very gently with the sponge brush that also comes in the bumper kit. And then there we have our own screen for printing. Now all we need to do, I'm going to pop that back in there one second, just pop that over there. I'm just going to pop, this can be a um, piece of kitchen towel, it can be a tea towel, I've got a microfiber cloth. So we're going to pop that on there, we need to leave it to dry completely and then as soon as it's dry you can use it as you use any screen sensation screen with your ink onto any surface. How exciting is this? I can't wait for you to get it home and show us what you made with it.